Are you still going to have Sidemen Sunday this Sunday or no because of Inside? Sidemen Sunday this Sunday is the finale of Inside. Inside is so good breath, not licking good breath. Honestly, been so good. Reminds me of the challenge, but YouTube edition. I'm honestly so happy with it. Is Inside supposed to be like a transition for Sidemen to make the channel more independent? Nah, I think, I think the idea is more like we could put, like we can make stuff like this. But the first one was like, uh, we have to show that we can do it. So we need to put it on our channels so that the most eyes see it possible. I really can't wait to see who's going to get eliminated. Nah, I see. We didn't want to do that. We didn't want to make it live because then it's, we wanted to make it like perfect and then upload it. And, I, and we really like the idea of like, I don't know. Uh, I, I don't want to say too much because it's not. Yeah, it's not done yet. Specs gone. He, he leaked it. Hey, they're all home. Just so you know, they're all home. So people say he hasn't leaked anything. Who knows? Maybe he wins. Uh, when's that on Sunday? I believe it's going to be like five, maybe six. I don't know. We're not entirely sure yet. Because we need to time it around the F1. Soccer Raid's also on. Like, yeah. Was it pre-recorded though? Well, yeah, it's not live. What time is the F1? Fan votes would have been popularity contest too. 7 p.m. Oh, okay. Well, then we'll. I think we'll definitely try and. I think it'll be like 4 p.m., 5 p.m. I need three-hour inside episodes. They are on side plus. They're only two hours. Oh, they're extended. How did you lot pick the contestants? Um, it was a mix of just trying to get loads of different personalities. So like, some are more outgoing, some are more reserved, some are like, I'll happily spend money. Some are like. I want to save as much. And it was just like finding, well, it was firstly five guys, five girls. I think, I think the, like the cast is perfect. I think they're all sick. Like they're all so good in it. And I know that there's villains and heroes and stuff, but honestly, I think they are like that, that 10 cast. They're all so good. And they're honestly all such nice people as well. They're all so nice. Perfect cast. Can't lie. So good. I didn't think I'd be interested in this, but I don't watch slash know the people, but ep two episodes in and I'm enjoying it. Yeah, I think it's also a good, a good length as well it's a week. Is Inside worth a watch if I enjoyed Locked In? I haven't watched an episode yet because I've been busy. If you enjoyed Locked In at 1 billion percent, 100 percent, we're getting a second one. I believe we will do a season two for sure. This was more about making like a, a proof of concept. And I think so far it's proven that it should be another there should be another series who do i think is the funniest in inside i'm not gonna lie watching it so I'll, I'll i'll give you a little um well you probably already know this from someone else we because we were like executive producing it we were watching like way more than just the episodes like we were there a lot we were watching like a live stream of loads of it uh, so like you know when there's a challenge that i'm not there for i had a live stream of it i think and I think a lot of the others will agree. And even people in the house will agree. I think Specs was the funniest. And I'm not saying that the others aren't funny, just to clear up. Specs was the funniest in there. I think they were all jokes though. But they're all funny in different ways. If there was no spending, it would be the worst series ever. Yeah, I think Weller was hilarious. I think Weller was very funny. I think Ginger was very funny. I think all of them are funny. But you've asked me who I think was the funniest. Any more side puns you can come up with? Yeah, we're going to release some shoes and call them sidekicks. Uh, we're not actually just to clear that up. Did not fuck with Joe before, but after this, man has jokes. Joe is hilarious. It was nice to see. That's another thing, right? Joe. A lot of people are saying like Joe was hilarious. Joe is hilarious. Well, was hilarious the last two episodes, three episodes. And Phantom, right? You're saying those two watching it 24/7. I thought Joe started like the first episode. I thought Joe was uh, really reserved. I thought the first day Joe was really reserved and I thought Phantom was, he was ill and jet lagged. So the first de two days, I think Phantom was, yeah, I think Phantom was kind of like, was, yeah, it was literally in the past, guys. It's not live. That It's all was. It's already finished. The whole thing is finished. So they was, or well, they were. Yeah, I think, I think Phantom was ill and jet lagged. So he was actually quite quiet. So uh, a lot of people were like, oh, Phantom is, Phantom's the funniest. And I was like, he gets, like, third day, he's funnier. Joe, second day, got a lot funnier. And third day, a lot funnier. Like, he came out of his shell. Phantom came out of his shell. 
I feel like it should be one episode a week instead of one per day. Nah, because then you've got to like, like for example, Ginger's reacting to it on stream, right? So if Ginger reacts to it on stream and it's one every single week, you think in how many episodes are there? Seven, seven days. In seven weeks, Ginger's going to be reacting to it. Like it happened. Then it would have happened like nine weeks ago, 10 weeks ago. That's what that, yeah, that's mad. Will all the others be in the show? I haven't seen Josh, Toby or Harry. Yes. Toby, it was weird. Toby was there pretty much every single day for a lot of it, but didn't didn't come in the episodes for some reason. Like the first day he was there and I was like, Toby, you're here. You may as well. And he was like, oh, no, 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 I'm not. Uh, I'm, I'm on this day's or whatever. Is that the new messy drink? Will there be a reunion? I don't believe so. I don't, I, I think it's, um, I don't know. I, the reunion, I feel like it, it can be dragging it out a little bit. Like I feel like, I don't think so. Maybe. Like, they might do their own things, to be honest. Invite them all back in a few months for a mystery box. Maybe it'd be good to get, uh, like, a couple of them to, like, be involved in a season two. Not in it, but be involved. Make them all do Among Us. I really want to do another one. The thing I hate is, like, I hate waiting, but I don't want to overdo it. One issue I have is the editing with the coming up. Uh, yeah, yeah. Is what it is. Gaming streams anytime soon. I keep trying to, like, I keep putting busy in my calendar so I can have some time to actually stream and make videos and stuff. And then it just gets filled up with, like, Sidemen Reacts and more Sidemen and stuff like that. Can you share who came up with the shop idea? Or was it collective? I believe it was a collective. Who's going to be in the next season? Literally, we don't even know if there is a next season at this point. Like, we'd love to do another one. The thing is, though, I saw people saying, like, when, when it, this got announced, People were like, my prediction about who will be in. And they would say stuff like, uh, they're like, oh, you're going to get like Sketch, Jinxy, Speed. And I was like, you're not going to get all of them to do a week for that, if you know what I mean. Happy with the views? 100%. The, the concurrent views, like yesterday's episode had 330 thousand viewers live. My only negative is we need to see you in the Sidemen a lot more. Yeah. I think we probably would be in a second one more. But I don't know. I actually enjoy watching premieres more for some reason now. I think it's so nice to watch the premieres and have the live chat. Max's watch time, it does. But I don't believe there's like ads on it. Uh, Zenab, yeah. We, we said about what if we did a one without like YouTubers and stuff. But like the amount of hate people send the way of people in there. It's just like. Yeah, it's it's people are horrible. You gotta remember that. ASG David Prime, and if you've not if you've not done if you've not done like social media and stuff, did it help the sidemen schedules calm down? Not really. Is it weird I don't want to support it because I missed the original content? Yes. That is very weird. Like if it wasn't your thing, fair enough. But the fact you're just not supporting it because of that, a bit weird. I think people would be more interested in people they already know. 100%. You need Jamie in the next season? Oh my god. Was it a 1 out of 10? It was. Yes. It was. Watching it live with the chat is way better. Makes it more fun. Yeah, 100%. I end up just having it on, like, on the side of, like, I'll be doing something and I'll have it up just to read the chat. Is it a 1 out of 10 on more side men? I believe so, yeah. The side plus ones are funnier than the ones on YouTube. Yeah, you get a lot more of, like, the, the extra stuff. Are you also watching it live or have you watched it before it came out? I was watching it actually live. Like, I was watching it a lot. Why did you make the funny part side plus? We didn't. It's just there was a lot. You got to remember, we're filming 24 hours with 10 people. There's a lot. How's training going for Sunday? Uh, not, not at all. I've been ill for like a week. So I have not trained. So, yeah. I'm going to be a big man team, yeah? It's not looking good, bruv. More side men subs are going crazy right now. Got an extra 50k in a couple days. Yeah. It actually isn't as many subs as I thought we would get, though. I know that sounds bad. But I, I low-key thought, I low-key thought it'd actually be more than that. We are almost at 8.5. I really want to get to 10 on that. Well, Sidemen deserve 10 mil for so long already. I know, right? More Sidemen is better than Sidemen. Do fan of that and an assist token, bro. If we do next side, you should get a place with an outdoor area. Then it wouldn't be inside. But I, I do kind of agree. I'm on the fence. Yeah, I'm on the fence. We, we actually did make that joke the other day about having a season two called Outside. And it's more of like a campsite. Yeah, we actually did say on one of the days we were texting. We were like, we need more secret challenges. We need to do more. We need to do more, blah, blah, blah. 
But I don't. I think because they weren't super planned, we didn't want to do too many that made it look like we were changing the show live. If you know what I mean. I I don't like the I don't like the public voting aspect of it. I'll be honest. What would I change about the house layout? So one thing I would actually change, which you won't know if you've just watched it, is you have the house. You have the house. Yeah, you go across the hallway, you have the bedroom, you go downstairs, you have the shop, the gym. It's actually another like corridor you have to go through that's off camera to get to the like the arena, the challenge area. That's the only bit. I don't like that others can listen when people go do the confessional. They're not, they were like, they're not meant to go down and do that, but also at the same time they can. How would you do public voting when it's all pre-recorded? No, I think people are saying that we would like, you shouldn't do it like that, if you know what I mean. You should do it live, but nah. Change the pool table. Yeah, I'd love to have more things in there. Like, like you know, there's the darts. There's the pool table. I'd love to make more things like that that are more they could, they could spend on it. Like, you know, have a table tennis table and have that, but, you know, they, they can buy the bats and balls for a day. New vlog when? Well, so I am filming, I'm going to film a vlog of Soccer Aid, but I don't know whether it's going to be like a, a, a main channel, like long vlog of like a few days, or if it's going to be a, uh, like I'll do like two or three on the second channel. 